Welcome, welcome, welcome. I am Haley Howland, and um, if you are new here, welcome. I am a mom of four from five months to six years old, and we are a homeschooling, homesteading um, family, and that is what I'm gonna be sharing on here. I'm gonna be sharing all things motherhood and how to just inspire your kids um, through learning whether that's through homesteading or through homeschooling um, that's kind of we blend that together so much so I am going to be sharing all things um, just in our morning time some of the books that we are loving right now and hopefully just give you some inspiration because I love books I love making memories with books I love my kids enjoying the books and so Anyways, I'm going to show you guys, go ahead and like and subscribe this video and um, introduce yourself in the comments, but also be expecting for more videos. I'm going to be sharing all things, like I said, homeschooling, homesteading, our home life. Um, so yeah, stick around and these are some of the videos or these are some of the um, books that we are enjoying. So um, the first one that we're doing, because we are doing the autumn guide from the peaceful press guys this is i don't know if you can really see that but it is from the peaceful press we love the people peaceful press so they have autumn guides they have unit studies that you can do and this one i thought would be so fun and it's so interactive so some of the things that I'm, i grabbed for that unit study um i've been going to the library every week and trading out our books to have like a new um, just new books. Um, and I also grabbed some books from Amazon. So I'm going to show you that and I'm going to share with you how I'm using them in our unit study and how we're just using them like as read alouds and all that kind of fun stuff. So the first one that I have been using like crazy is the magic and mystery of truths. This book is beautiful. This has great resources for fall, spring, winter, um, summer, and it has such um, good illustrations in it, but it also just has such good information. And so I've been using this as a reference for my kids, and um, we've just been having such good conversations. And so they have, I, I really have been using a lot of interactivities um, about leaves and different things, like that, different things like that. I've been using a lot of these pages for our fall study. One thing that I did grab as well today from our library is the mystery of monarchs, if you can see that. Um, it's just so beautiful and we have so many monarchs on our property right now and I thought it would just be really good to just like go outside and study them and just add this to one of our fall read alouds. Um, so like I said, this is it. This is called the mystery of monarchs. Um, and we're actually going to be um, planning a fall garden. We just got done with our summer garden and my kids helped me with that. And we planted some sunflowers about a couple weeks ago and, um, now we're doing our fall garden we have like a bunch of pumpkins and things like that we're, we're planning so i thought this would be so fun to do for like poetry tea time it's called behold our magical garden poems from poems fresh from a school garden so this one i just picked up at our local library um and you could probably just order it from like thrift books or uh, Amazon or something like that. But they, it's so cute. The illustrations are so cute in here. So um, that is something that I'm going to be using even in our morning time, our morning basket, and just like kind of transitioning uh, into schoolwork for us. Um, and then another one that I grabbed today was The Biggest Pumpkin Ever. So that was a fun book to read about like pumpkins and all the things, right? So, um, just really cute illustrations in here, but, um, uh oh so I grabbed that one, and then another one that I have been, our kids, um, I got from our local library was The Bee Man, 
And this is a really cool book because we do a lot of nature studies, a lot of nature walks, and we have bees everywhere. My, my son is really into insects right now, and he's really into watching things about bees and wasps and stuff like that. The really fun thing is it's showing um, this girl's grandpa and how he takes care of the bees. So it's very informational, but it also shows what they do for the bees in the fall time. So I really enjoyed this book and my kids did too. So um, those are the those are the books that we're kind of reading this week and then I'll go back to our library. I go usually every Wednesday and I switch out our books and then some of the books that we have been reading from our Amazon haul in the morning time in our morning basket that I wanted to show you and then also one of our read alouds because this book if you have not read it it's amazing so the one of the things I've been doing is like as a kind of like a devotional along with our Jesus Calling book we have um, this kids Jesus Calling book and I kind of pair these together um, but this book is amazing. It's called 50, 50 True Stories of Daring Women of God, um, Courageous World Changers. So this is the women's book, and it's just all different kinds of women who, kind of like a short biography of them. Um, it's not too short, but it's not long enough where it's going, going to lose your kid's attention. But I love it because it's all different kind of women throughout history and I it's it's a very very good book so I've been pairing that with my de our devotional in the morning time and just kind of like seeing where it goes and our my kids have really liked it so um like I said they have the men's one too and I'm excited to finish this one and then change out to the men's one um so one of our read alouds that we have been doing we've been listening to the chronicles of Mar Narnia in our story time like in the car and things like that but at night time we have been reading um this amazing book so this is called little pilgrim's progress and we are loving it it is such a cool adventure for our kids so anyways that's our read aloud right now i'm loving that book Tell me what you're reading in the comments. Um, share with me some of the books that you're enjoying. I would love to hear from you and just be inspired. Um, my oldest just walked in. Hi. So I'm going to head out and I will be um, coming back here and uh, uploading more videos for you guys. So I'm excited. Like I said, go ahead and tell me what you're reading in the comments. And um, I hope to uh, talk to you guys soon. Bye. Bye now.